I'm Abby and I'm a graduate student in Jim's lab and today we're going to be doing a demonstration on bromination of alkenes. So um, if you look at this test tube rack, we have three different chemicals. Um, so in this test tube we have hexane, in this test tube we have cyclohexene, and in this test tube we have toluene. Now they're all colorless um, and clear. Um, but we have one that's an alkane, one that's an alkene, and one that's aromatic. Um, and we are going to be adding bromine in dichloromethane, which is uh, this kind of brownish red solution. Um, and if the bromine reacts, then the red color will go away. So anything that remains red has unreacted bromine in it. So let's start by adding the bromine to the hexane. So we still have this orange solution, which means bromine is still in there. Now we'll add it to the cyclohexene. And if you can see, upon addition, the orange color goes away. So we can show you that one more time. So we're adding this bright red solution and the color goes away. Now for the toluene, we still see the bright red color. So what we're seeing here is that the bromine is reacting only with the cyclohexene, not with the cyclohexane or the toluene. 